Hey, this video is for someone who's just installed the Mate desktop and thinks the themes are very gross and wants to return to the ancient gnome look from 2012 or so. Um, those have been preserved at this GitHub repository, github.com slash lah7 slash a-m-b-i-a-n-t hyphen m-a-t-e, link in the description. Um, the instructions given in the readme file are slightly incorrect. This folder is not where they belong. Um, I've tested this on Rocky Linux 9, as well as OpenSUSE Leap 15.4, and in both cases, uh, following these instructions uh, simply does not work. I don't know if it's a distribution-specific thing, or if it, you know, just a a many years ago thing or whatever but in any case here's how you're here's how to actually install these cool retro uh, themes nowadays uh, you'll simply go to this page hit the releases uh, click on zip I've already saved a copy once it downloads uh, go ahead and open it uh, double click on the main folder user share themes uh, select every file in here then click extract now if you don't see your dot files you have to press ctrl h to show them look for a folder called dot themes if you don't see one click here to create one uh, once you found or created your dot themes folder go ahead and enter it make sure selected files is checked then click extract once the themes are extracted click close, go back up one folder, then enter icons. Again, select both the folders here, click extract, go back to your home folder and look for a folder called dot icons. If it does not exist, go ahead and create it, then enter it. Make sure selected files is checked, then click extract once more. Once it's all extracted, go ahead and open the appearance menu. And now you'll be able to access the Ambient Mate Dark and Radiant Mate themes. Now, if you don't like those icons, you're plenty free in recent versions of Mate to just click Customize and return to your favorite icon theme. Well, that's all, and I hope this helped.